Dead end? But it feels strange. This is... Net Slum? There are those who call it that. We call it Paradise. Where's Helba? I guess we should talk to the people here. That is a gate for only those who have been acknowledged by Helba. You cannot use it. The fake real? And the real fake? Which is real? The fake... Are you really awake right now? Don't bother pinching yourselves. Our dreams are very realistic. I have enough light, water, give me water, and warmth. Are you really awake right now? The process of seeking the truth is perfected by repeatedly questioning yourselves. Isn't it similar to the process of making distilled liquor? I name myself from this reason. Before you ask for help, it is necessary to think yourself. Hence, I do not have the intention of answering your question. I want to ask about Helba. You done? Uh... 
Are you looking for Helba? Uh, uh, yes. It so happens I briefly heard from her recently. The epitaph of twilight. To sum it up in a nutshell, it is a tale. Or to elaborate further, it is a saga that recounts how the age of the spirits came to an end. The tale of an end? Indeed. However, the texts are scattered. Even if found, they are extremely difficult to comprehend. Yes, it'll be a very tricky business. Say, uh, there's something that's been bothering me. The people around here, they all look so different from anybody I've seen anywhere else. This place was once where all of the unsuccessful non-player characters drifted. Sort of a sanctuary for failures. Then, players who considered them amusing came up with their own variations of failed characters. Now, the boundary between player and non-player characters is quite indistinct. Some of them simply don't know which category they fall into. There are, maybe, even those who have lost their bodies on the outside. Mere memories, faded reminders of the individuals they once were. Only their character data remains intact and active as they wander the network. Yes, the same fate as Harold. Harold? I must speak with Morgana to go where she is. The living flesh poses a hindrance, but I must. I must go for our aura. Emma, please give me a little more courage. Helba! They're the words of the creator of this world, Harold Hewick. Well, you wanted to see me? Epitaph of Twilight. Both of you have succeeded in reaching it as well, I see. Oh, look. We have an unusual and unexpected guest. As a representative of Net Slum, I greet you. Welcome to Paradise. Huh? Ball Monk. You sided with Leos, I see. You cracked easily for someone who was so sure of himself. Don't judge, I'm not like you! Stalking the boy is shameful behavior. You've disgraced the name of the descendant of Fianna. What? Ball Monk? You used us? It was necessary. To restore order. Order? There's an order that the world desires, and then there's the order that you desire. Which form should it take, Ball Monk? The order that I desire, of course. Featured performer. Now all the actors have assembled. Quit your yapping, woman. You are entities that unquestionably pose a grave threat to this world. I'll delete you all! Ah, what did you do? I haven't done anything. This is her doing. It would appear that she doesn't care for us very much. Her? Yes. In other words, this world itself.
Let's go. We'll head back to town. Maybe this was a turning point. The relationship between me and the game The World has gone beyond pure amusement. And it was spreading beyond the network.